All right, you guys, what's good? Welcome back for the video. Today I'm touring apartments. Um, I've got quite a bit to look at today, but we're starting bright and early, like I said, and I'm excited. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really excited. You know what's crazy is all these freaking apartments look so similar. It's like, what? <laughs> they all look so similar, it's crazy. I think I just must have chose like a wrong day to come and do this. I might have to come and actually do this tomorrow. Um, it's Monday, so a lot of these places for some reason are closed. So much, and I've already went to like a few places. I just lucky deleted a lot of footage because every place was telling me this. So I always have that to look forward to. Well, I have to wait a little bit, but this is perfect because it gives me enough time just to sit here and just chat with you guys. Um, it's been some time now. It hasn't been like the longest time. It hasn't even been a month yet, but it's been some time now. Um, I know it may seem like, oh, you're so happy now, or like, you look so happy. How did you switch from being so sad and then to so happy? Those videos were like filmed some time apart. They're not like I filmed it like this very, very day. Like this very day is, I think it's seventh right now. Anyways, um, but It's just, I'm still trying to find myself and figure everything out. I do, of course, still have moments where I'm very, very sad and I cry and I'm like, it's weird to not have the person I was with and sleep next to them or wake up with them and do all the things that we'd normally do and be up and out and about all the time. And it's just a lot to adjust to. Aside from doing like, getting myself up and finally going out and like trying to look for a job or look for an apartment like this all has taken so much time to do it's not like I just up and left and the next day I'm all ready and happy and ready to go like this has all been a process for myself but I'm just trying to look at the positive yeah I actually I am looking for my first apartment <laughs> Okay. I'm just looking for like a one bedroom, maybe like a loft would be oh, cool. Bedroom? Okay, um, did you, okay. I'm not sure how it's supposed to go. I don't know if I'm supposed to make an appointment or if I could just walk in or. Uh, yeah, you can, I could take you as a walk-in. Um, you were looking for a one bedroom, right? Mm-hmm. Let me see what we have available for you to view. Um, is there like a floor preference? Um, anything has, I want. I want something that has like a lot of lighting. A lot of lightning. lighting. Lighting, um, yeah, it's really important because I I do film, okay. so I'm gonna need a lot of like natural so, like, lighting. In the top floor. Yeah, that'd be fine. Okay, um, let's see. High ceilings would be cool. Um, I don't know if you have like a loft. That'd be nice. Uh, a loft. Let me see what we have. Unless you want to wait a little bit longer, because to be honest, I don't if you're looking for something like uh, for like lightning and it will be the loft. Right. And I would have to wait for her until she comes back. I'm not sure when. Maybe like a couple minutes. Okay. And until she walks in, because I was giving a um a tour right now. And um, when she comes back, I can ask her what loft I can show you. Oh, I can I can take you up and show That's you. That's right. Can I ask? Um, is there any like smoking in this building? Um, uh, I don't think. Well, I think there is, but outside, like, the area. But you would have to have, like, uh, someone living in here that way you can go inside. Oh, let me grab this. But for the most part, there's, like, it's not really, like, a smoking building. Okay. Uh, there, there is an area where there is a smoking building. Yeah. I, I was asking if you wanted to smoke right now. Or no, no, just, like, in general. Like, yeah, if you so live like, here, yeah, like... No Area, correct, right? No, we don't. We don't. There's no smoking here? No smoking. Oh, okay, that's perfect. Oh yeah. my god. Oh. Okay. So yeah, that was like a big problem at the other spot, really? so I'm just, yeah, I just okay. didn't. I wanted like a no smoking okay, place. So no smoking, perfect. Yeah. Okay. And then um, she wants to know if we have a loft available. No, we don't. What about any one bedrooms? We do have one bedrooms available, but we just don't have any loft units available. Do you have anything with a lot of lighting in it? Yeah, the one right next door. 
The one that I just, uh... No, this one right here, I just went to it, I have the keys. Okay. Can you show it for now? Yeah, yeah okay. we just need your ID and yeah. hold it in the office. Sure. Okay, so this would be the first spot. Oh yeah, there's pretty decent lighting. You just open up those little yeah. windshields. Oh yeah. And you put the TV this way, or I think it'll go this way. And then you put the couch this way. The ceilings are like the highest, but they're not like, it's not like it stops like there and comes all the way across, so that's good. And then this would be the bedroom. So have this big window here too, so that's cool. Oh yeah, it is a lot of natural lighting here. Wow, look how nice this is. Wow. Then here's this little closet space, and then, oh, that's a little walk-in closet. This is like perfect. Wow. Extra for your towels, or for, for my towels. Wow, this is nice. This is literally perfect. Is there a way to switch? I mean, this is like probably a tedious question, but is there a way to switch out that lighting inside the, or on the mirror to like a bright dim? No, like one more brighter. Unless you put a different um, bulb that's but, more brighter. But, that, but that's possible to do? Um, let me check. We can ask them. On the on the mirror? Yeah, on, oh, on the mirror. On the mirror, I don't think so. Oh, okay, okay. Unless it has a different... Like a mode or something? Yeah, which I doubt, but... I mean, either way, it's so nice. Yeah. Wow. And it's pet friendly? Uh, yes. Okay, good. I have two dogs. Yes, it is pet friendly. Oh, I love that. You can literally just walk right out and just walk them. Yes. Oh my god, that's so convenient. This literally walks right out onto the street. Yep. Oh, wow. Look, I'm outside. How cool. Oh wow, this is so cute. You like it? I do like this. Do you guys have anything else like that's similar to this? Uh, similar to this one? Or even a little bit bigger is fine. How much is this? This one I would have to see in the okay. office of that. Since we have several ones available, I'm not sure how much is this one. Oh, I, I didn't even realize. What is this? Is it a wash and dryer? Yes. Oh wow, okay. Wash and dryer. And a little coat closet? closet. Oh yeah, this is good. Yep. I can put all the dog's food and extra stuff in here. Oh, that's yep. so nice. I love the little backsplash is cute. Oh yeah, the appliances are nice. They're up to date. They're not like white appliances. That's cool. Yeah, this is really cool. I'm glad you like it. I love <laughs> the, the window on the top. I know, it makes it so much, it feels so much brighter. I don't know why it feels a little bit bigger because of it. Yeah. It's nice. I'll give you more information in my handbook because I just, I'm just helping them here at the moment. And then, uh, I'll look. Um, answers to your questions. Oh, no, you're fine. Well, we can definitely ask for a show. Let us know. I'm excited. This is my first apartment on my own. I just really? got out of a relationship, so I'm like moving out of there and like it's Hopefully been a process. I know. Hopefully. Yes. Crossing my fingers for the best. Yes. <laughs> oh, did you want someone my... Uh, yes, we can shake it. That's totally fine. Did they ever like shake it? Did they ever like break the habit? I have. I have an uncle who never did. Yeah. Yeah, I had an uncle who never did, and then I, my brother was in, he, I mean, he said that he's an addict for life, and he was able to break it, but it's just really hard. Because they have to really want it, and they stay that addiction is like, uh, it's like a thing that they do when they're in that phase. It's like an illness, it's not just like. As simple as like you're overeating, right? Like, oh, you can cut back on food, but with drugs, it's just it's, it's hard. It's not necessarily like okay, so I don't know if I maybe I'm just over, like I don't know, but it's because I had like a family member that I lost to smoking cigarettes. But the reason that we had left was because, or I had left was because he smoked cigarettes. Yeah. But I mean, I met him like that. Yeah, but I mean, and like, but we've always talked about him like shaking the habit or like stopping it because I didn't like it, and like you know I lost like family members like that, and yeah, I don't know. 
it's yeah. not it's not a joke you know and a lot of people take it, take it as like it's so light like oh it's not like he's doing crack or he's cutting himself or he's doing this it's like but you're still causing like harm to your body and to yeah. your like you know like th that causes like harm later on in life I mean, he started very young, like very, very young. So he's been doing it for years. So it's just like, that's just in you now, you know, it's just like, but if you can shake that habit off now and just like try and get clean and be healthy, like, I'm sure like, I'm sure like nothing bad can come of that. And like, I think smoke, I think that's like the, um, I don't know, I, smoking is just so gross. To me, you know, it just it makes them smell, and then also not just like the issues that it can cause in that person's lungs, but it's just like like your teeth, your teeth, your gums, your all that stuff. And then also it gets on everything, like the smell. It's just like uh, I, I just feel like it's like. I, I think they could do it for sure. I I feel like he's strong enough because he stopped one time and he stopped for like three months. Yeah. But I don't know if he fully stopped because I feel like he was probably like sneaking some every now and then because I yeah. think I would smell it like on him, yeah. but I wasn't sure. Yeah. But a lot of people are thinking that I'm taking this like a little too far for no. leaving him and like, oh, you're giving up on him and blah. I'm like, no, no like I want better for him. And it's like, if I'm still around, then he's going to think I'm never serious about yeah. it, you know? No, I mean, I think end of the day every person has their own standard and it's not up to anyone else to be like oh you're being ridiculous right because it's like maybe they have standards that are different from yours right you know and it's all about what you want for your life and my mom would always say like you weren't born with him you were not born with him you're not gonna be married with him right like you are your own person and then if people let you date, if you're dating with intention, that's like something that's going to be the father of your kids. Like you have that's to what I'm off. saying. Like, that's exactly what I'm saying. And oh my god, I did not mean to be like trauma dumping no, on you. Okay. And I literally, literally had I've not talked to like anyone so in depth about it because like it's not necessarily that I want anyone's two cents in either, but it's just like I don't think that anyone would understand unless they went through something that had someone to do with like an addiction. Yeah. Or if they lost somebody, like they don't wouldn't fully understand, you know? Yeah. No. And so everyone else is thinking that I'm just over exaggerating or like, oh, but I'm like my feelings are completely valid. Like yes. I just want him to be good and safe and like I want to be able to have kids, you know, like and yeah. oh my god. Yeah. I, I went to the doctor, I got checked and I'm they said I'm good to go. And we've yeah. been trying for like five years and yeah. nothing's come of it. Well, also, um, I think it does, it, it affects like sperm count. It does right? yeah. a lot. And also like people don't believe that, but it's like what the man consumes and his habits, like it also determines like how healthy your sperm is. Right. So if, like if you're with someone that's like on drugs or like is smoking and drinking all that, like your sperm is not going to be as healthy. So your baby can also come out sick too. That's what I'm so. saying. And on top of that, they're like putting their stuff inside of you and that can throw you off balance to like mm -hmm. everything. Yes, you're completely valid. <sighs> okay, I'm, I you're thought that I was crazy. just like, no, you just... have no idea how many people are against me about this. Like, so many people. Really? So many no. people are and like. Are, it, it doesn't matter if it's like, you know, you met him like that. It doesn't matter because it's like when people come together, no it's one's like I'm your, Yeah, like yeah. on top of that, you're blocking your blessings like that. Like, I come into your life to help you be more positive and like. And be like better, exactly, and, and it's all about what you want for your life. It's not because you're not the person that are gonna have to live with this person and deal with these issues. So yeah, like, exactly, exactly. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I feel yeah. less. I feel like more <laughs> okay about myself now because I thought for a second like, am I making the wrong decision? Like, should I just go back home? Should I just like? Yeah. But then at the same time, I feel like if I go back, nothing's gonna change. No, nothing's no. gonna change because if they're you, used to that. Because if you don't show that you are willing to get up and leave, then they're going to be like, okay, well, maybe like not consciously, but it's like they have no threat. There's no fear of like, I'm actually going to lose her if I don't get this shit together. Right? Exactly. Yeah. Sometimes all you need to do is just talk to a stranger. Because I feel like someone that doesn't know you isn't going to just try and lie to you or like, they don't know me and they don't know the other person. So they're completely not even involved emotionally, logically anything like that like they don't they don't know us so it's like i feel like when you talk to somebody that's completely outside as a third party perspective looking inside of a situation i feel like those people always give you the most like clear-headed advice because they're just hearing it straightforward and like 
giving you an opinion. But that's exactly what, that's exactly, see, I was thinking completely logically about this. I don't know, man. I mean, I do, like, I know what, I, I know I need to do this, like, you know, I'm, anyways, I want to look at more apartments. I want to get a good, a clear idea of what I'm going to be paying. All that, I want to make sure that my dogs are going to be in a good spot, in a safe area. I want to make sure that the spot that I'm in is completely, like, secured. We have security that goes around, all that stuff. Um, but I'm about to go and take a look at a few more apartments. I'll record them. I'll show them to you guys. You guys can help me pick a spot, potentially. Um, of course, I'm not going to tell you, like, what area I'm going to be in. But I'm going to keep looking. And then also just like a little update, I I didn't hear back from the job yet. I'm still waiting, but um, I'm also going to still be going on a few more interviews as well to see what what random job I can land. Whatever it is, I'm down for it. All right, this is apartment number two. Same backsplash. This is really cute. This is more higher, like it's more like up in the building. It's more spacious, but the ceilings are a little bit shorter. Yes. So when you come in, you'll see that it's like not so high, which is not bad. Like it's not, it still looks really good. And then here's the washer and the dryer right when you walk in. And there's a little coat closet, kind of like the same layout as the first one, but opposite. That's like, it was on that side, now it's on this side. And then here's the living room slash dining room area, if that's what I want to do. But I think... The TV might go, does it go there or does it go there? TV? I think, no, that's for like phone. It's oh, TV here. here. So the TV will go here, then you have the couch here, which is totally fine. The view would be of like the community, basically, like the inside, not really the outside. And then this would be the room. Oh, this is really nice. There is lighting. There is pretty good lighting in here. This is nice. You go down, then you have the little, you have the walk-in closet. I feel like it's probably, I think this one's a little bit bigger, actually. Then you still have, like, the side walk-in closet. You still have the section for your towels and everything. And then here is this restroom. I don't know why I feel like the lighting in this one's brighter. Like, <sighs> This is so unreal. <laughs> so unreal. I kind of wish that this was a different color, but I mean, it's still doable. It's nice. It's really nice. I got three more spots to look at, I think. But this isn't, this isn't, this isn't bad. This is nice. And you got the window. Get some nice wind in here. It's still pretty bright. Yeah, it's nice. I didn't even show you. There's like a whole balcony right here. When we step outside. Is there any spot for storage? Um, this one, no. Okay. I don't think it has much storage. It's still nice though. Okay. This is a similar layout. It's just, it's a little bit darker. And it's, this one goes like underground more, huh? Like technically because of the, this like little wall. Yeah. Makes it kind of like that underground feel. Yeah. Oh, the lighting still helps. Yeah. If it's different, huh? Yeah, it definitely is different. The backsplash, even on the kitchen, is different. So everything inside, for the most part, is all the same. It's just the layout and where it's at. Whoa, it feels brighter in here. It feels brighter in here. That's so odd. It's like... I don't know how I really feel about this, like, underground thing. I need more lighting. What? This is really nice. It's really spacious it though. Up. Yeah. It's a very similar layout, but this is really nice as well. And it's cool that it's like right here, you can see everything going on. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fight right there, I'll see it. This one is dark, but I mean, it's so long. Yeah. This, yeah. Whoa, this is long. There's a lot of space in here. 
Oh my god, look at me steps I had to take just to go in there. I don't know. Then you have like your little balcony right here. Is this what, the coat closet? This is the coat closet. This is so cute. They're still cleaning it, so I don't mind the stuff around. Oh, what? You're fine. Oh, this one doesn't come with the washer and dryer in the unit? Whoa. The layout is a little bit different. It doesn't have one of the closets, but the toilet has like its own little space. And this unit, for whatever reason, doesn't come with the washer and dryer, which definitely presumes an issue because I need a washer and dryer for sure. Oh wow, this one's so long. Mm -hmm. I think this is why this one's like more bigger. For some reason, I guess because the light was already. I think it's glaring off the water. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. It has like a little more oceany vibe. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. Look at the water's right there. You have like your own little like. Hidden patio. Oh, this one's different, I think. The windows, huh? Oh, yeah. Why you have a whole full window? A whole full view. That's why it looks brighter in here. How are you able to get out? You can't get out? I don't think this is a door. I think it is a window. <laughs> this is a really big window. But you cannot get in. Oh, yeah. It is a balcony, no? Balcony, no? I think that's just a window. Am I tripping? Wait, because if this opens, this unlocks it yeah, and that spins it to open it. This unlocks it. And you have to spin it. Maybe yeah, the other way. Like, yeah. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> it's just a window. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was going to be a door. Like a sliding door or something. You could have been like Alice, you know? Like in the. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I'm going to open this up real quick. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to step out. And the rest of the layout is basically the same as the rest. The closet. The closet, the side closet, and then the restroom is the same. It's pretty big. We'll see what we decide after. Let it go. All the boots are like whoa. Thing I go. Cause you don't I see. I see. I got a better now, girl. Yeah, got your car. Yeah, no, I swear. 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 I